Looking for a career that's always in demand? How about one that provides you with practical and useful skills? A career that allows you to earn hands-on experience and an education with little to no debt? Oconee Fall Line Technical College prepares students with the right set of skills to succeed in fast-growing careers in healthcare, manufacturing, business, and technology fields. If you're ready to gain the experience you need to start your career locally, OFTC is where it all begins. Oconee Fall Line Technical College. Careers begin here. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are in the halls of East Orange Primary with the lovely Miss Janelle Butler. How Good are you? Good morning, great. Always excited to see you. Always. And look at this dress. <laughs> you are ready for it today, Miss Butler. I am ready. I am ready. <laughs> all right, now listen, you know, when you're talking about back to school, there's a lot of moving pieces. Mm -hmm. So, Miss Butler, you all have been very busy, haven't we you? We have. We sure have. My teachers have been working hard like they do every year because they are so excited to have our littles come back to us because right. they're adorable and we love them. <laughs> so they've been working hard, getting those classrooms ready, mm -hmm. getting all of our curriculum set up, everything yeah. that we are working on with them. We've got some new writing things that are going on that mm -hmm. we're very excited excited about that we know are going to help our kiddos to For achieve sure. even more. And you know, you get so excited and so giddy when it when these kids come down this I hall. I do, I do. <laughs> I have the best job in the world. I get free hugs all the time from adorable children. Like, who could beat that? Absolutely. Who could beat that? And how long have you been doing this? How long have you been in your principalship? So this will be year four here oh at ELP God. for me. What's been your takeaway? What do you love most about what you do? And what have you found, Miss Butler, to be the most challenging for you? What I love absolutely most has to be the kids and the staff that I work yeah. with because my staff, I mean, they are second to none. Yeah. I don't want to say too much because I don't want people trying to take my folks, <laughs> right. but they are absolutely the best group of teachers yeah. to work with. I mm -hmm. mean, I give them something to do and they run with it. Sometimes I come to them, I'm like, we should do something. They're like, oh, we already started working on that. <laughs> they have read my mind already. I love that. I mean, as a challenge, I think we all have them, you know, yeah. day to day, just getting everything in, yeah. but you know, somehow it always gets done. For sure, so for sure. I don't even worry because I'm oh, like, yeah. it's going to get done. And you have the best attitude about it. <laughs> well, you know, I figure we're going to be here anyway. We yeah. might as well be excited and happy. For sure. <laughs> and you've got to a few new staff members coming on. I have just a few, so we're very excited. Now, Coach Ali Good retired, which we congratulate him on, but we will miss him. Mm -hmm. But Coach Vivens is coming. People <laughs> used to know him as Deputy Vivens, but now he is Coach Vivens oh. here with us, and we are so excited about that. Mm -hmm. um, and then we also have Miss Tristan Oliver is joining us. Mm -hmm. And she's going to be in one of our pre-K classes. And yes. we have two new paras. Um, we have Ashley Meeks, who's just got married. Yeah. I think it's Ashley Briggs. She'll forgive me. I told her, <laughs> just forgive me. Um, and then we have one new kindergarten para, Danielle Hansen, who had oh, both, all of these people have actually been with us in other capacities. So we're just very excited to have them back with that the fam. So wonderful. And so what do you do to kind of corral everyone together to kind of build that morale starting out? And of course, when those doors open, <laughs> up on on Tuesday morning I mean, well we always have like a little big back to school with our teachers here yeah. and we do breakfast because people love to get fed <laughs> and um, I told them that's the most important part of this meeting yeah. and then I just always try to do something like fun and energetic and just something and we get together yeah. and enjoy each other and we're all about growing together this year yeah. so we set some goals together and worked on each other's strengths because like I said my people have so many strengths yeah it's amazing so and I love that because when you're talking about a really good leader is being able to identify your areas of you know I wouldn't say just weakness but mm -hmm. things that you're not as you know mm -hmm. as sharp on yep. and having a good team around you that fills in those gaps mm -hmm. so that you could be a really strong strong unit oh I have the best team I, my teachers are <laughs> fabulous but I cannot talk enough about my assistant principal Miss Sherry Kite mm -hmm. like she's my right and my left hand cannot make it with that day without that lady she is fabulous my Counselor Claire Bryan, I mean, I don't know how many hats she wears. It's got to be yeah. like, you know, mm -hmm. unbelievable if we mm -hmm. put them all on top of her head. And yet she comes in here every day and gets it all done. And my instructional coach, Donna Flanders, fab, yeah. second to none. 
I love that. It's just great. And so for parents, is there anything, Ms. Butler, that you want to make sure that the parents know before they come into these doors? Any kind of instructions you want to give? Any kind of words of, of wisdom you like to give to those parents? Because some are bringing their kids for the, the first time. I know. Appreciate. I know. We just want you to know that we will absolutely love them like they are our own. We will take care of them and we understand some of them are going to be nervous. The parents probably a little more than oh, yeah. them, but it is going to be a fabulous year. Yeah. My teachers are just thrilled to have them come and all of my admin team is as well. So it is going to be wonderful. Just bring them here. We promise we will work through the little nerves and get them where they oh, need to be God. every year. I like, I love it. You'll find me in the pre-K classes those mm -hmm. first few weeks mm -hmm. because my little babies, some of them, this is the first time they've been to places. Some yeah. of them have gone to like a daycare, but mm -hmm. some of them, this is their first experience. Yeah. So we want to make it a happy and a fun one while they're learning at the same time. Thank you so much, Ms. Butler. Thank you for the love and care that you have for your staff and for these kids because that's what really is so important when you see that trickle down effect of how you are with these kids and they cannot it cannot help but be contagious <laughs> well your i appreciate that and your expertise so we certainly appreciate you so much well thank you i appreciate everyone i have the best job in the world so. Oh my gosh, and you're doing it well. Well, thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Ms. Janelle Butler, the principal here at East Lawrence Primary. Ready for some good barbecue? Come on by Southern Heritage Barbecue, 2276 Veterans Boulevard. Home cooked Southern barbecue served fast. Barbecue by the pound, mouth-watering ribs or delicious Brunswick stew. All at Southern Heritage Barbecue, 2276 Veterans Boulevard. For those special orders, call ahead, 275-4304. Southern Heritage Barbecue, Dublin.